Hello and welcome to Mark Productions. You are here, me, Matthew, and we are back here with Pokemon Go. Now, before we get started, let's just calm down. Let's uh, take a chill pill because this is going to be massive. We found a load, and I mean a load, of different um, new Pokemon, um, some rare Pokemons. It's just been amazing. It really has just been amazing, and that is the one way of describing this. It is literally amazing. So, before we get started, of course, we're going to have to put on a lucky egg. So, we're going to put the lucky egg on for half an hour. So, we've got half an hour now. Hopefully, it won't take too long. Now, straight away, you're probably seeing what the heck is going on here. The Aerodactyl we got from the egg, you saw that yesterday. But, hello, Arcanine. Yes, we finally got one. Bearing in mind, I know it is, it's not the best. No, it's not the best, that's fine. But look at the candies, 26 candies, which is rather cool. And we have a pretty high Growlithe, so hopefully it'll beat that. We might be in the thousands for that. Uh, Bell sprout wise 85 candies, we're definitely getting up there. I'm probably going to aim for about 125, and I'm going to evolve this guy, because I think he's going to beat the... Uh, the weeping bell we've got at the moment. Uh, in terms of Blastoise and Squirtle candies, we've got 49, so we're halfway to 100, which is rather cool indeed. Bulbasaur still on 10, so that's not no change there. Now, as we're going down here, uh, this is actually Chris's Scyther. Um, <clears throat> reason I've called it Chris's Cypher, or at least he called it that, is because he caught it. It was quite a low one compared to some others which we might have caught. Um, you can see we've got quite a few Clefairies. We've got a nice 6 to, uh, 620 there, which I will evolve. Um, as we move down, uh, we got the Dugong, the Diglett there with 23 candies, so not bad there. Um, we found another Doe Duo, so we got 15 candies for that. Maybe going to get another Doe Trio soon. No news on Dratinis yet. Very, very slow on that front. 164 candies, though, for Drowsies. Look at all the Drowsies here. I've sort of wanted to keep high ones, maybe like over, over 400, because I think they normally give you a nice sort of... Uh, what would you say? A nice sort of one. Th oh, it's going to be over one thousand. That's that's confirmed. Um, look at all the EVs, though. I've kept a lot of these again because they are really, really high. These are topping six hundred, which is possibly some of the highest ones I've got. Again, look at this guy. We have an Electro Buzz. This was amazing. And of course, we can just power him up. Um, but he's only on four eighteen. Now you can get better ones. But we've sort of narrowed down where the best place to go is to get them. So hopefully we'll be able, we'll be able to get more. Um, we hatched this in an egg. And then we also found some um, out in the wild, which was pretty cool. Have a look at the ghastly candies. 96. We are so close to getting a Gengar now. Hopefully next week we'll have a Gengar. That will be really, really cool to show off. Um, in terms of Oddish slash Gloom slash Vile Bloom, very slow on that front. Just really looking for 5k eggs to give me those. Um, you do see a lot, well, I say a lot. You see, you see a very small amount of Oddishes. Um, so it might be good to try and track down some place for that. Geodude, though, let me have a look at this guy. 46 can... No, I don't want to power him up. What are you on about? Um, <clears throat> 46. So we could get a Graveler. The only thing is I might want to just save it for 125 because we can go from a Graveler to Golem straight away. This guy is the highest, obviously, but I've kept that one as well. Just for trading because it's sort of... It, they both came out of 2k eggs, which is really, really cool. Uh, we also found a Wild Gold Duck. Now, bearing in mind it's not the highest, which is fine. But the Psyduck candies are insane. 71 there. There's our Growlithe there. 740, which I'm guessing could be an absolutely amazing 1000 type sort of Growlithe, which would be really cool. Horsey's not doing bad. we got 22 candies on that one. Load of Hypnos there, all looking pretty cool. Look at this. Jigglypuff, we're ready to evolve, which is going to be awesome. There's the Jolty on there. Now, anything comes from these evolutions is going to be amazing. By the way, evolutions, we're probably going to be able to do two. Jinxes, look at what we've got here. Now, the reason I haven't got rid of the low ones is just because I don't want to. I, they, 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 you know, To me, they're sort of a rare Pokemon, but around... My area, they seem to be very... <laughs> There's quite a lot of them. Um, but, uh, yeah, there she is. She annoys me because she keeps coming out 10k eggs. Let's just put it that way. Uh, we found one Abra, and that was it. It was a weak Abra, but hey-ho. Uh, there's a Kakuna there, ready to go. We got the Kingler over a 1,000. 
Coffin is 30, it's not really close to a wheezing yet, maybe if we can get it in an egg, maybe two eggs, that'd be brilliant news. Look at all the crabbies though, I've kept these, um, but our highest here is 476, look at the candies though, we've got 101, um, which is really, really cool. Matchup, not really getting close yet to evolving him, um, but that would be really cool to see. Magnemite, why have I not got rid of this one? We got 21 candies from Magnemite, so they've definitely gone up. I think we got this guy in an egg as well, which is really, really cool. Um, have a look at this guy. Very weak, I know, but look, we have a Mr. Mime. That is so, so cool. Um, <clears throat> we have a Mankey here. Look at the Mankey candies, 34. We're on our way to a Prime Ape, and that could actually be a really cool one. Look where the bar is. That could be really, really cool. Magikarps, of course, you've got to have an update on that. 185, very specific there. Um, looking to get maybe over 200 by next week, maybe 250. That's my sort of aim. Um, need around females, though. We're on 76. So they're slowly but surely progressing, and having Chris with me really helped because he was able to grab a lot of them, um, sort of focuses, focused his attention on them. Um, in terms of a need around male again, we've got 23. So I'm going to sort of just, if they're, if they're there, take them, and then hopefully we might be able to get another Nido King, which would be really, really cool. We've got two Oddishes here. Now the reason I've kept these two Oddishes is because they're pretty high-ish. Um, and i honestly thinking of maybe trying to get up to 125 and then doing like the highest oddish um, so we can save ourselves. Now of course we got this in a, in a uh, 10k egg which is a 476 onyx which is actually quite high on the, um, the scale there. I've kept the 151 there just in case for trading. Um, Paris has been doing pretty well. We got 58 so we'll be able to evolve him. A lot of evolving coming up um, which is going to be awesome. Our three Pidgeots there. Some uh, Four Pidgeotos. Uh, I think we caught two wild ones. I'm pretty sure maybe three. Look at all the Pidgeys though. 370. That's got to be an awesome one. I've sort of kept it over 300 as my sort of aim. Have a look at this though. We got two Pikachus. Um, of course, we got one from an egg. Um, but this is just amazing. You know, 17 out of 50. Um, we did also see a, um, a a wild one, but it ran and I it was it was terrible because I think we threw about 15 Pokeballs, all random ones, raspberry in it every time, and it just did not go in. It was a pain. Ponytar, of course, we've got an amazing Ponytar at the moment. Leveling that up should be an absolute beast, but it's, uh, that's only on 11 at the moment, so nothing to be majorly excited about. Psyduck, though, this is one thing to be excited about. Looking for maybe over a 1,000 here with this to go to up, a, up to a Golduck. We got two there because they're quite high. Polywag candies are doing pretty well, actually, 86, so we're getting there with that one. Um, maybe next, next, um, I'd say next week, possibly, maybe a Polyrath. Who knows, I would stick around for that. Uh, 319 on the Rattatas, there's tons of Rattatas here, they're all over 300. Here's the beast here, though, Scyther, coming in at 1,013. That is a pretty cool one. Um, now, you're probably wondering, why did the, didn't the other one is down here because the name is different because it's called Seagush's boy um, that's why um, so we've also got a seal here over over half of that and that's a pretty cool seal Shelda we're very close to evolving into a cloister again found another slow poke and it's a pretty high one as well we've got 30 candies for that no we didn't find that sorry we hatched it in an egg Spiro 51 so we'll be able to do that one We've shown off the Squirtle Candies coming down here. Staryu's only got three. Tangler can't evolve again. Tentacles, I think, got 12. Um, Venonat's doing pretty well on 34. I got a Wild Venomoth. This is the Wild Venomoth I got, um, which was 1,023, which is pretty awesome and pretty insane. The Volpix there are 25. Voltorb, very, very slow indeed. Um, I just really want to try and find him in a 5k egg. I think that would bump his candies up considerably. Weedle's there. We've also got Zubat on 304, which is extremely awesome. So, we've got our we've got our egg. It's on 21 minutes now, so let's get going. Let's get all the way back down to the bottom. And we'll work our way all the way up to the top as quick as possible. So, here we go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Zubat, right. Evolve. Let's go. Let's get some XP. We are super close to leveling up to 23. Um, this week has been insane on the leveling up front. Uh, we, put, if if this was any other week, we might have leveled up twice. But this was just crazy. So here's a goal bat. We're looking for something pretty cool on this one. It's got to be over a thousand, I'd say. With the 370 uh, zoo bat, you're looking for over a thousand in terms of a goal bat. It's a 987. Okay. Interesting, fair enough. 
Okay, so a 240 Weedle here. Let's evolve that one. Plenty of caddies, 121. Um, so you could probably get almost two ev evolutions out of that, I'd say. But there's going to be a lot of ev um, evolutions in this one. It's going to be off the scale. Um, but there's a Kakuna there. Doing his ultimate buzz of ultimate destruction. I'm going to say about 250. It's normally pathetic on the uh, evolution. 261! Hmm, okay. Uh, so we'll evolve him again because he is the highest. Okay, we go into a B drill. Could we be? I, I'm I'm not thinking we're gonna get a thousand B drill just yet. I don't I don't think it's gonna be. I don't I really just don't think so. It might be a high nine hundred, but would it would it crack in the thousands? Probably not. Oh, don't do this, GPS. Come on. No. Wow, that is actually really pathetic. Wow, I was expecting something. Oh, he's got X scissor, which is pretty cool. Um. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Right, we've got all that. We can't do anything here. No Squirtle evolutions just yet. Spiro, let's do the Spiro one. Evolve 50 candies. Go for it, Spiro. This could be pretty high. Maybe a thousand would be nice to see. But who knows? It might not be. <laughs> Knowing our luck, it'd probably be like 987. <laughs> okay, so Spiro to Firo. Firo, come on, be over a thousand. Be the first thousand Firo. Oh, 959. Wow. Whew, that was close. Okay. So that one's done. Shelder we can't do. Seal we can't do. Seedra we can't do. Scyther doesn't evolve just yet. Um, Sandshrew, there's not much going on there. I've only caught one. Very, very slow progress there. Ratata, three. No I love how many candies I've got. I could evolve se seven. Yeah, I could evolve seven of these guys. Crazy how many Ratatas you find. But we're going to evolve this guy because he's the highest. See how many more we can get. Who knows? We might even bump into a 400 Ratata, which would be insane. Could this guy possibly beat out our Raticates? Let's have a little look. Let's scroll that up. Scroll that down. There he is. There. That's it. You yell at the screen. You yell at that screen. 806. Really? Come on. That's the weakest one I've had. Wow. That's shocking. Oh. Okay. So this would have been a. <laughs> This would have actually been a proper evolution, like we'd actually like be able to unlock it. But because we found that, what I think we actually found it at a law. Um, we found it at a law. Uh, we picked it up. I say we, because Chris was with me. Um, it needed to be. <laughs> but uh, here we go. Let's see what we can get. I think it was a six. I think we. Well, I think we could could be on for maybe about a thousand here. I think that'd be pretty cool to see a uh, gold duck in the thousands. Not looking for majorly insane, but 1,100, 200 would be, I think, the nicest thing. Maybe a double XP would be amazing. Come on. Oh, my God. What? 1,346. That's amazing. It's got Hydro Pump as well. Nice. Oh, that is so, so cool. That is awesome, awesome news. Wow, that is... I wasn't expecting that at all. Um, you can see we've got two pincers now. Not getting rid of them. They can stay right there. They're doing really, really well. Uh, we're, <laughs> we're getting a lot of pincers. Right, so next thing is a 370 Pidgey. So at the moment, our highest Pidgeot is 670. Uh, sorry, 677. Then our highest Pidgeot at the moment is 1,205. Can we beat this with this 370? I think we might be able to push quite high. Because I, I don't know. I, I think that Pidgey is the highest I've seen. I'm pretty sure. I think I got this from a 2k egg as well. You get a lot of uh, 300 Pidgeys from 2k eggs once you get to that stage. So we're looking for 677 or higher. 677 or higher. Maybe a 700. Oh, okay. GPS signal right at the wrong time. 674. Wow. Okay. So... <laughs> That is weaker than, I believe, a wild one. So we can actually evolve this one because it is the highest. I mean, we could evolve more because we've got so many Pidgey candies. It's unreal. It's unreal. Plus, it also gives us the XP, I guess. So, uh, <laughs> okay, here we go. Pidgeot, come on. We're looking for about 1,300. Would be lovely. It really would be lovely. I know it doubles the XP. It doubles the CP. At least, I think. No, it doesn't. Oh, that was... Ooh, ooh. 1,180. Wow, okay, that comes second. Wow, literally two two away from uh, becoming third. That's interesting. How many candies have we got now? 182. Oh, what the heck? Let's just do it again. It gives us more XP. Let's do another one. We get so many of them anyway, so... Well, yeah, we may as well. So this is the one we literally just got from that Pidgey. 
Will it go really, really good? Who knows? Let's have a little look. Okay, okay, come on. 1162. Okay, so that did work out. That worked out the right way, to be honest. Uh, I'll keep the Pidgeots there. I'll keep all my Pidgeys. I'm not going to get rid of them. But if we can get maybe over a 400, I might think of getting rid of all of these. Um, just to get the candies. Right, so at the moment, our Parasect is very high with 1,007. The Paris here is a 502, which is quite high. Possibly the highest. I don't know. I think I might have evolved a 480. But let's see if we can beat that. I'm hoping for maybe a 1100, 200. I said that for the gold duck and it worked out higher. So maybe, maybe we could be looking at something pretty beastly here with this Parasect. There he is. Slash she. Could be a she. Who knows? Okay. That was, um, that was disappointing. 969. But I'm not going to get rid of it because that's ideal for trading. But that, that I was expecting a little bit more than that. But I might have powered up that one to get it over a thousand. I'm pretty sure I did. Uh, can't do anything here. Meowths I can't do with it on 39. Mankey can't do. Of course, can't do a Magikarp yet. Magnemite not yet. Krabby we can do. So let's get the highest one. See if we can beat that Kingler. 476. Wow, that bar was extremely high. Could we be looking at maybe a 1,200 here? I don't know. We'll have to see. We'll have to definitely see what is going on. What is going on with this Kingler? Come on, Kingler. Be a beast. Be an absolute beast. 1,112. It beats it. It beats it. That's good. And we can keep the other one as well, which is really, really nice. Uh, can't evolve it, um, a Jinx. So that's fine. But what we can do is a brand new evolution here, which is Jigglypuff to Wigglytuff. This is going to be pretty cool. It's 506 at the moment. It's quite high. I believe I got this one from a 2k egg. We'll evolve it. Oh my god, I thought it just bugged then and it's just stolen all my candies. Wow. Okay, come on Jigglypuff. Let's have a thousand Wigglytuff. I think that would be the, the best sort of thing. But who knows, it could only be like an 800, 900. But we could be wrong here. It could triple it and become 1,500 and be the, possibly the highest one. Wigglytuff registered the Pokedex. That is awesome news. Look at all of them. Get out of here. 1,215. Are you kidding? Are you kidding me? Wow. Um, there's, a, there's a Haunter there. <laughs> Just show the Haunter. Why not? Look at the Golbat difference. Wow, that is crazy. Goldeen to Sea King is 38. We don't really want to focus on that one. Geodude we're not going to do. Flareon we're not going to do. Fearos are doing pretty well, actually. Um, I think we got the 969 one. I'm pretty sure we did. Can't do the uh, Execute. Ekans is extremely slow. Extremely slow. We're going to do two, two evolutions. Now, I'm going to literally just put this to Fate. I'm going to tap the Evolve button and put it to Fate. Whatever we get... Hopefully it beats whatever. It could be a Vaporeon. If it's a Vaporeon, this is going to be a beast. If it's not, then hey-ho. But, okay, it's a Jolteon. If it's over a 1,000, that's good. As long as I keep the other Jolteon that's over a 1,000, because that would be the best thing to do. 1,234. Okay, that's pretty cool. That is pretty cool indeed. Let's do the 607 now. Evolve that. This comes down to luck. I'm not using the names now because it didn't work before. Or at least they've stopped working. People have said there's limited time. You get like three goes or one go to eat. Oh, really? Another Jolteon? Come on! God, Jolteons are really like... Okay, so let's just check this one. 1,219. Come on, Jolteon. Why? Why, Jolteon? Why? Right, okay, let's do a Drowsy to a Hypno. 578. Let's evolve this. We could evolve three. We really could evolve three. I might, I might actually do two. I might do two. I'm going to do two. I'm going to do two because we need the XP. We need that XP. Come on, let's do it. Okay, come on, Hypno. Be a beast. Be about a 1,300. 1,300 would be amazing. Amazing. Okay, it's only a 1,195. Let's do another one. Evolve. Yes, please. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Yes, 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 that's it. Go on up you go, Drowsy. 
become a hypno which will probably be maybe about 1150 that's my guess 1150 can I get that sort of close 1150 Ooh, okay it's not bad it's not bad um, Okay, do do we can't do Diglett. No, we can't do. We're not even halfway on that Clefairy. We can do Clefairy. Clefairy, we can do. So let's do a Clefairy to a Clefable one again. It's crazy how many you get. I've seen people actually like being like really unlucky with this. Like they haven't even got a Clefairy yet, and I'm like, whoa, hold on. You're in the UK. So am I. What's going on? Can you beat the one I've got at the moment? Come on. Be a boss. Be the boss. 1,295. Oh, it's close. It's very close. Very, very close indeed. So, let's actually evolve this Caterpie now. We've got plenty to evolve it into a Butterfree. Can we possibly get a pretty cool one? Let's have a little look. So, this is going to go to the Metapod. And then straight away, I'm going to just do it. I'm just going to evolve it. And we're going to see what we get. And we're going to work from there. That's lovely. That's lovely. It's just lovely. That really is just lovely. There you go. Up you go. Two, four, six. Okay. We're going to evolve them again. <sighs> we must have evolved about 20 here. So uh, normally, don't you get a thousand for each evolution? Plus, I got the lucky egg on. It's normally 500 for an evolution. Now it's a thousand. Right. Here's the Butterfree. Okay. Be an awesome Butterfree. Be an awesome Butterfree. Be an awesome one. Seven eight eight seven eight eight. I thought it was a butterfree. I thought that's what it's called. Uh, oh, there it is. <laughs> wow. Um, okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. We got two pretty high ones. I mean, how do they scale? Oh, the bar's not bad. I mean, there is room for improvement, definitely. Uh, the bee drills there. I think we got the seven nine two. I think we did. I'm pretty sure we did. Um, but in terms of evolutions, I mean, that's pretty cool. Look at that. We've bunked up to 190 now. I might need to get some more room in my um, pokey, pokey holder, pokey bag. Look at that. My God, we got five over a thousand hypnos. We've got to have a look at the, this uh, combat power now. Okay, here we go. Let's get ready to faint. Oh, wow. The Golduck is now third. I got a hypno that is... Why is that Clefable dead? Why is she dead? I might put her in gym. I don't know. Um, or oh, it's a Jolteon who's in ninth. Wow. <laughs> look at all the Jolteons. The Wigglytuff's there. So they are actually pretty high. I mean, look, we've got pr actually a real nice amount here. Hold on, let's have a little look. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, <laughs> 30, 33, <laughs> 36... 37. 37 over a thousand Pokemon. Still the highest though. Oh, oh, look at that. We're level 23. That is amazing news. What do we get from that? Oh, more Ultra Balls. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Wow. 20,000 XP. Oh my god. This grind. This is going to be a grind and a half. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh wow. Look at that. Kanto. 99. So we need one more Pokemon to to literally get a hundred in our Pokedex. Let's have a little look at the Pokedex though. Look at this. Court 99, C99. That one that was letting us down was that Arcanine, which we've now got, which is amazing. Um, <clears throat> so let's go through this. Let's just go through what we're missing. We're missing Ivasaur, Venusaur, Charmander, Charmeleon, Charizard. We're missing um, Ekans to... No, Cobra. No, it's Cobra backwards. Albok. There we go. <laughs> Pikachu to Raichu. Uh, we need a Sand Slash from the Sand Shrew. We need a Nido Queen, which we're pretty close to. A Nine Tails. We need a Vile Plume. We need a, D a Dug Trio. We need a Primate, which we're close to. We need a Polyrath, which we're close to. We need a Ab um, Alakazam, which we're uh, getting there. Matchamp to Mat no Matchop to Matchamp to Matchoke. We need a lot of them. So five K eggs have got to be on our side. Um, we're quite close to a victory victory bell. So fingers crossed. Maybe next week. Who knows? Depending on our bell sprout luck, but depending on our five K luck as well. 
Geodude to a Graveler, we could do, but I'm going to wait for that so we can do all three of them. Ponyta to a Rapidash, uh, we need a Magneton from Magnemite. I don't know who 83 is, but I'm pretty sure it's Farfetch'd, which you can only get from 5k egg or from going to a different region. Um, we need Muck from a Grimer, I've only seen one Grimer, so that's going to be pretty slow indeed. Uh, the Gengar, who knows, that could be next week, which would be amazing. We need Electrode from the um, from this guy. From Voltorb, wow. Um, the Execute goes to an egg Executor. Um, then 145, 7, 6, and 7. Which one are they? I don't know. I'm not too sure. Uh, coughing and then a Weezing. Rhydon to a Rhyhorn, or Rhyhorn to a Rhydon. Uh, a few other rare ones there. Nice bit of colour here now. Still need to get a Magmar. Um, the Magikarp to a... Uh, la, 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 Magikarp to a <laughs> Karados. How do you not know that? Um, the Om... Om... Num, num, Omanite to an Omni Star, I think it is. We still haven't even got a Kabuto yet. That goes to a Kabutops. Um, of course, we've also got all the legendary Pokemon as well, which are not out. Um, one of these as well as a Taurus. Um... Mr. Mime is a regional specific Pokemon, I think, to Europe. So I've got that. You get them quite often here. So that's pretty cool indeed. But in terms of an evolution, that was pretty awesome indeed. Uh, we're now level 23, which I'm very happy with indeed. I'm very, very happy. Um, I'm probably not going to be seeing 24 for a little bit of time. But um, maybe, oh, I don't know, maybe two weeks. Dep it depends on how much time you've got and whether... Um, you find like really good ones, you've got the lucky eggs to put on and everything like that. We'll just have to see what's going on. But yes, I shall leave it here. So thanks very much for watching this. This has been an amazing, amazing thing. We're up to level 23 now, which is amazing. Um, so yes, if you have enjoyed this, make sure to hit that subscribe button below. Also, let me know in the comments below, would you like to see, because this is a new feature that a lot of people are talking about, IVs. Would you like me to go through all my Pokemon and show off what sort of IV they are? Um, the higher the IV, the better. And just quickly, if anyone didn't know what an IV is, it's basically the sort of overall power of the attack, stamina, the defense, the special defense, all that sort of stuff. And it, it's basically calculated through the CP and the HP, um, and obviously what the actual Pokemon is. Then it'll give you a specific number, and you can place that on there, and you'll know that that is the sort of strongest. So if it's like 94%, that's going to be a pretty cool sort of IV. Let me know if you guys are interested in that and want to see me place IVs on all my Pokemon. Um, and also, rate the video as well so I know you're enjoying the series of P Pokemon Go, because I'm absolutely loving it still. It's just amazing. It's so, so crazy, and it's just really, really awesome. But yes, there we go. I'll leave it here, so thanks very much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you, and goodbye.